Hey, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for the 25th. So this is for Friday, January 25th. Keep in mind that the timing is fluid. So even though I say it's the 25th, you know it could be any time. Memories of the past. <laughs> Very prominent, huh? Memories of the past. Maybe childhood memories even. This could even have something to do with your inner child. Memories. Memories are resurf resurfacing for some one reason or another. This is nostalgia. Remembering something. Remembering love, remembering your childhood, remembering something. A lot of things are at the surface, huh? Oh God. Oh boy. You know, I don't know, I don't know. Uh, death, memories. Um, Endings bring up memories, right? I mean, that's what happens when something ends, when something dies. The memories all come flushing right back. Something has been burdensome. Something has been heavy. And it looks like it's coming to an end. Somebody has given up. And I mean, he's no longer standing at the point of collapse. I, I can't do this anymore. Somebody can't do something anymore. Releasing something, a heavy burden. Deciding to choose one, one route, one thing over the others. Knowing that that's what has to be done. This high priestess has been coming up so much. Somebody's following their intu intuition and seeing the situation clearly. They've gained a lot of wisdom over the years and through solitude. And it's like now somebody is doing what they have to do. You know, I know what I gotta do. This person is listening. Listening to the intuition. Knowing that they have to let go of the rest. I have to let this go. It's killing me. The truth, accepting the truth. Somebody is uh, taking the power in their own hands and they're making a cut. And the cut hurts. When you get cut, it hurts. Whether you get cut out of someone's life or you get cut by a knife or you get cut, when you get cut, it hurts. And somebody has made a decision to make a cut because it's they have to follow their truth the truth that they know they can't hold on to a dead end situation anymore despite the memories
and the person that got cut there's memories in every direction the very first card this is the painful truth the raw truth about the past perhaps oh god deception now he's holding the five of swords this is the two of swords it's a painful decision painful choice the five of swords we know what that card is it's a lose-lose situation. Whoever you're dealing with wants to win at no, no cost, at any cost, at any cost. Doesn't care who they hurt, right? Hiding. Somebody has been hiding. We're going to get the rest of the cards before I go any further. Oh, this person keeps showing up all the time. Somebody is taking action to shed the burdens. The magician takes action to shed, to bring success. The only way this person can bring success is to shed something that doesn't serve them, to let it go, to, to, to let it go. Somebody is taking action to let go of a dead-end situation where there's no growth. They may have cheated. I don't know. Somebody has lied and deceived and hidden the truth. Could be somebody from your past. Maybe this person has had this influx of memories and, you know, now they know what they got to tell the truth. They got to speak the truth. Maybe they've reached the point where they just can't take it anymore. Somebody can't take it anymore. Can't take it anymore. Can't live this lie. This one, this is like, I, I need to take action to bring success. Magician uses his resources to take the power back, to take, to use his power. And this is taking power back too. Somebody is finding their inner power to, and their inner strength, their inner everything to follow their intuition, to follow the script, to let go of something that doesn't serve them. To go after the abundance. I just want to enjoy life. I just want to be happy. I just want to, you know, grow, evolve, enjoy life. act with integrity it's like the storm is over somebody has uh, realized you know this is about gratefulness grateful for everything realize that they had a lot to be grateful for and this is realized as well somebody has realized something about the small things right Perhaps that somebody did for them? I don't know. Somebody may have realized that, you know, they have to follow their own path. I have to follow my own path. And they may have thrown away an opportunity that was solid, stable, and secure. And now they're awake. They see it clearly. It looks to me like there's going to be some communication coming through. This is communication that somebody has made a decision, okay? Somebody has made a decision of some sort 
to make a change. Somebody has made a decision to make a change and end something that was burdensome so that they could bring success and abundance back to their life after probably throwing something away. They want it back. This way, because he wants to go back. Somebody wants to go back. Somebody wants to go back to the abundance that they threw away. You've got to, you've got to look at what's mirroring each other, okay? I want the opportunity that I lost. Now so this can go another way. Somebody is deciding that I will find my own abundance. I will drop this burden because I have the power. I have the resources to do it all by myself. I don't need your instability. I don't need your insecurity because I already know the truth. Somebody is ending a difficult situation. I'm not kidding. It's like the storm is over. And we have a new beginning here because somebody decides to take action. Now we got a new beginning because with death brings rebirth. Endings bring new beginnings. Somebody has ended something with a person that hindered their success. That hindered their abundance. Let's get some more cards. Somebody is going back. Somebody has been hiding, pretending, and they're coming back. They're, they're, they're coming back. I don't know what this is. Now, this, this could be, um, you know, the Six of Cups is a soulmate card, right? Everybody knows that, that reads tarot. It's a soulmate card. It's like reuniting with a soulmate. A lot of times with death, I mean, I don't even know where this is coming from. People die and reunite with their soulmate. I don't know what that is. Or endings happen so that people can reunite with their soulmate, whether it's in this lifetime or whatever. Whether this is a past life connection or a now connection or whatever this is. Somebody is reuniting with a soulmate. Okay. After they didn't have the courage to do the right thing for quite some time. Somebody let fear get in the way. And um, bad decisions. But now they want this passionate new beginning. It's like all of a sudden they're ready to take a new approach and they got this new fire in their eye and they got this new desire to go after it. He's got the Ace of Wands. Like I said, this, I, 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 I know what I want. I don't want all this. I don't, there's only one thing I want. Somebody's going after that one thing that they want. Whether it's being single or being with the soulmate. I don't know which one it is. Justice. Justice, doing the right thing. Yeah, somebody is about to uh, make a decision that is fair and just. They may have been involved, involved in a karmic situation and now they see it clearly. This is totally seeing it clearly, okay? Somebody is totally seeing a situation clearly, all right? It's like the truth is coming out. The truth has been revealed, whether it's been been revealed from within or from another person or whatever. Somebody is seeing the truth. The truth is coming out. All right. Somebody's going to speak the truth. We can only hope and pray. Anyway, um, this is acting with integrity to bring, you know, justice to a situation. I don't know who that is for. 
somebody threw away that opportunity. This is an opportunity that's already been lost, okay? And somebody wants it back. There's n that's no joke. They realized they should have saved it when they had it. And it's like maybe they want they want to they want to save it now. They want to save it before it's actually out of sight, whatever it is. Um, this can also be turning away from a family. Somebody could be leaving, or or from a from a commitment, turning away from something that once was stable or whatever. This could be. This could be ending. This is like upright. This is building a legacy. Reverse. It's like ending a legacy. You know, or something like that. Somebody may not want to let it go. Might not want to let it end. I don't want to let this end. I want a relationship. Because this is reversed. The ten of, you know, tens are completion. It's, there's an opportunity to save something, you know? I don't know. It, with hard work. Somebody's going to put in effort to save something. Somebody is. Somebody's going to put in effort to start fresh. Start at zero. Start over. Somebody's about to have a major new beginning here. It's like... Starting completely, completely, completely over. So it's like a death and rebirth here. Something ends so that something brand spanking new can begin. That's true justice right there, too. Somebody may have been hiding their feelings for quite some time. Really listening, trying to, you know, really make sure that they were making the right decision to leave something, to end something, so that they could begin again. But somebody has decided that it is time. It's time to take this new approach. It's time to follow my passion and go after the one thing that I want. And you know this is this is one 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 one. One. So we got four ones. We got four ones here. So one 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 eleven eleven, right? There's definitely two people coming together that are meant to be when you get 11-11, right? That's what this is. They're meant to be. It's a soulmate connection. It's somebody that you already know, whether you know them in this lifetime or not. Whether you knew them in this lifetime or whatever this is. Two soulmates are coming together for an opportunity to start fresh. With an opportunity to start fresh. This was a heavy decision that somebody had to make, but they've reached the point where they can't take it anymore. They can't take it anymore. It looks like they're ready to put in effort. They were going to do anything to make it work. I'll do whatever I got to do to make it work. I'll work harder. I'll work harder, harder, harder. I think that somebody has done their homework, okay? They've done their homework and they're ready. They're ready. They're ready to go. And it's going to happen. 11 11 is fast moving. So this is fast moving energy. Somebody's in, in 11 11 is also highly intuitive, okay? Somebody's intuition has been telling them it's time to go, it's time to go, it's time to go. And they're about to go. They're about to take that leap, take that risk. And follow 
follow that opportunity, that passion that they have within, you know, it's like, I got to go, go ahead. And this does signify, go ahead, go ahead. We have a new beginning here that is starting because somebody is letting go of something that doesn't serve them and heading towards this, the soulmate. They've been, they've been hiding and wanting to come back. They've been wanting to go. They've been wanting to go this route. They've been wanting to, but their fear was in the way. Fear and probably another person. This is usually the other woman, whatever it is. Somebody was in the way. And she's usually the other woman because she's impulsive, just for those of you that don't. I mean, fire, and I'm not trying to judge anybody. I'm just telling you what the cards mean. Very impulsive. Somebody has lost some abundance and some stability and security because they threw something away. And I think that they want that stability back. I want this opportunity back. I, whatever it is, I want my stability back. I want my security back. I want my, my, uh, I want to enjoy life again. So yeah, we have somebody that is starting over at zero, starting fresh. in a completely different direction. They got this new vision and they're gonna take action. Somebody is releasing something. They're releasing and beginning a new, I mean, releasing and beginning a new, okay? A new journey, a new chapter, a new a fresh start. After, the, after their fear and perhaps another person got in the way. And it doesn't have to be a fire sign. It can be any sign. I'm just telling you the meaning of the card in reverse, okay? Somebody got in the way of this connection. But now these two people are reuniting, whoever they are. Some truth is going to be revealed. Now, I have to remind you, this could be somebody that you haven't met in this lifetime that you are uniting with. It could be because this could signify a past life relationship. This person has been watching and they see that you've been doing very, very, very good, whoever this person is. Anyhow, let's get another card here. We're going to get one of these. We have a new beginning here because somebody is releasing. They've been through some sort of transformation and they're ready for their new life. I'm ready. I'm ready because death is a new life and the fool is a new life. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready to go and begin again. So somebody is going to be beginning again. And there's going to be an instant spark, okay? This is an instant spark. All of a sudden, the sparks start flying. Taking shelter. The answers are within. Remember, I told you, somebody's been, it's very intuitive. Somebody's intuition has been really talking to them. No joke. And they've been listening. Or they're listening now. They're listening now. I don't know. Retreat. Replenish your inner resources. Incubate your ideas for the future. Renew your energy. Do whatever you need to do to take care for yourself. Mend physical objects in your home. Organize your possessions and heal relationships. Protect yourself from a less than positive protect yourself from less than positive outside forces clear clutter 
but at the same time gather your resources around you. You are preparing for a kind of springtime energy, which is funny, okay? That's a springtime energy. You are preparing for a kind of springtime energy in your life, but take care of the details and create a foundation now before this spurt of energy. Otherwise, it can seem overwhelming. Be oh, jeez, I'm crow. I mean, that totally makes sense. So somebody has been overwhelmed getting ready for this new passionate beginning. When winter comes or a storm threatens, the traveler takes shelter. It's time. It's a time of incubation, retreat, and gathering of inner resources. It's time to plan and prepare for the future and for springtime. New beginnings and a new cycle. That's what's happening. Somebody is about to start a new cycle because they release something and follow. They follow their intuition. They get this new vision and they start to listen. They start to listen to what they hear. And when they do that, they bring all the good things. You know, when they speak the truth, they receive a good karma, right? Somebody is making a decision to go in a different direction. And it is the right decision. It absolutely is. Because it's going to lead you right you soulmate I mean what more can I say starting over good luck